here to play a lovely piece called Meditation. Please, please welcome our reigning Miss America, Gretchen Carlson. Welcome. I have never been to Washington before until late last night, so when I found out I was coming to the Miss Washington pageant, I was excited. And I've had a wonderful reception from not only the pageant people, but some of the community members also. And you know, it reminds me a lot of the people in my home state, which of course is Minnesota. And <laughs> oh, some Minnesota people back there. If you remember back to the pageant on September 10th, I was Miss Minnesota. I grew up there my whole entire life. I have a wonderful family back there. There are four kids in my family, and my dad has a car dealership that's older than the Miss America pageant. I credit my family with getting me on this stage here tonight. They were my main support system. I was also the first classical violinist to become Miss America. And this thing right here has been my best friend for almost 17 years now. Well, actually 17. I just turned 23, and I started playing when I was six. So it is 17 years now, and originally, I wanted to be a professional violinist and perform in New York City in Carnegie Hall. But I reached a burnout stage, and sometimes that happens to children when they're really dedicated to one thing, whether it be music or sports, and I became involved in a lot more activities. And that's when I first thought about becoming Miss America. So I guess you could maybe consider that I have reached my dream of being a concert violinist, just in a little different way. Tonight I'm going to perform for you a slightly different number than what I did at the pageant in Atlantic City. It's a much more romantic number, if violinists can be romantic, and it's called Meditation by Thais, by Massenet also. Thank you. 